Is the Earth awakening? Is it actually happening? Could it be that you and I live in a time that this planet has never known? That we live in a time where consciousness is awakening, where enlightenment is rising up and a shift, a powerful shift of energy is encompassing this world that we live in. Folks, I believe it's true and I'm going to share with you in this video not just why it's happening, but how it's happening and how you can be a part of it. So if you want to be a player in the great awakening that we are beginning to experience on our home planet here, Earth, then hang around because today's video is for you. My name's Ben, welcome to Elevate. This is exciting, so let's jump into it. Well, well, well. Welcome back, so great for you to tune in today. I'm thankful for each and every one of you. So thank you for stopping by. If it's your first time here and you like what you hear and see, why not consider subscribing to the channel? And to all of our recent subscribers, those who have linked up with us on Facebook or whatever, a huge welcome to the family. I'm thankful for you, I appreciate you. So please feel welcome to reach out to me. If you need support, if you need love, just shoot me an email, reach out anytime, get involved in the conversation below. But I want to talk to you folks quite briefly today on the subject of a global awakening. You see, there are two schools of thought on this, I suppose. Either it's happening or it's not. I believe it is. I believe that the world we live in is speeding towards a great awakening. And in fact, I believe we're even on the threshold of it right now. There have been tremendous accounts of people who have gone through deep, deep hypnosis, deep regression. There are countless studies into people who have reached enlightenment, who have had spiritual awakenings, who have had dramatic shifts in their life. And these people all say the same thing, whether it's under hypnosis, whether it's under deep regression, or whether it's simply having come through an awakening and an enlightening experience themselves, they all say that they chose to came, come to earth now to be a part of what is happening Never before in recorded history have we seen so many incidents, so many reports of the supernatural. Have we seen so many people journeying with the spiritual and the supernatural? Now, I'm not talking about people getting bogged down in religion. I'm not talking about people to subscribing to man-formed ideas and ideals. I'm talking about people on their own journey, a journey where they are open to everything and attached to nothing and in such a journey experiencing the fullness of the universe coming to meet with them right where they're at getting in touch with themselves and their higher self and coming into an alignment with an understanding that allows them to move into their purpose and move into their destiny and move in power and be a part of this uprising this awakening and as if that's not enough, we know that we shift through parallel reality simply by observing what we choose to observe. Folks, quantum mechanics tells us this is true. Quantum science says that a universe and a reality cannot exist without a consciousness to first observe it. Therefore, with our consciousness, we observe our reality and it is unique and individual to all of us. We know and there can be no doubt that we are infinite energy. We are a spirit being who is having a human experience. We are a spirit who has come to earth 
to be clothed in the human body, to have the experience as a human. Just like you may play your favourite game on a computer. It might be a game like Fortnite, or it might be a game like Gran Turismo, or Grand Theft Auto, whatever it might be. If you could physically step inside of the computer and play as that actor and that character, it's the same sort of idea here. If you could go to that computer game and have that experience as that character, live that experience, in the same way your spirit has chosen to come to earth, has come now, and is having a human experience. Therefore, you are a spirit. You are a spirit who has a soul and who lives in a body. So the way that we take part in the great awakening that the earth is beginning to see and the great unfolding glory that is ahead of us, the great shift in energy and the earth and the people of the earth coming back to an understanding and an alignment with their true, higher spiritual selves. If you want to be part of that, it's as simple as understanding and letting the understanding take root in your heart that you are not who you identify as, as a person. I am not the Ben that you see in front of you. Therefore, I must stop identifying with my shape, with my size, with my features, with my voice, with whatever it might be. Stop identifying with all the good and all the bad you see on your body because it's just your house. And start identifying with that which is on the inside of you. Start communing and communicating with your spirit. Start getting to know your spirit. Start listening for its promptings and its guidings because your spirit will guide your body, will raise its vibration, and that is how you manifest. That is how you come into alignment and live out your destiny. You see, we didn't come here to achieve nothing. We weren't born just to go through cycles of life, careers, relationships, frustrations. We weren't born just to go around that mountain until we'd 70 or 80 or 100 and then die again. We were born, you were born, for such a time as this, for a specific purpose, for a reason. There is destiny and promise in your heart. Get in touch with it, find it, uncover it, and guard it. Guard it more than you would guard silver and gold. Treasure it, cherish it, commune with your spirit. And as you do, the attachment to the identity of the human flesh, the body, it will fall away. And you will come into alignment with the great energy that is happening all around the world right now. We are all divine beings. Therefore, vibrate, resonate high. Get an alignment with your divinity. And there you will come into alignment with the energy force of the earth, of the universe, of the entire world. Folks, I believe and I declare that great things are ahead of you. Start this journey today. Get in touch with you on the inside. Reach out to your spirit and ask your spirit to guide you through your life's journey. You'll be amazed what happens. It's a great journey. But from me for today, I'm over and out. So I pray this has blessed you. I pray that it's encouraged you and has lifted you up to know that you can be a player in the awakening that the earth is going through right now. I love you so much. Thanks for being here with me today, folks. I'll see you again tomorrow. Peace.